model of Rogue Glide is that? 20. 20, 2020. Looks new. Yeah. Well, I tried to get it. I tried to get this young man there to give me the old, uh, old time discount. And he said, "Well, uh, no, I needed a military discount." I said, "Well, I'm retired military, so do I get that too?" I don't think he's going to give me any uh, breaks here, so I don't know a lot about the rogue lights. I expect it's probably a, uh, maybe a low 12 second bike. One of the things that you're going to do on the clutch, you'll, you'll have your RPM, and once you get your second one, you want that clutch just to be just about where it's pulling you forward, okay? It's just short of pulling you forward, so when you do let go of it, you're only going to let go of a little way, it's not the whole way. If you leave, if, you're, if you break the beam on the, on the second uh, beam, where you stage before the green is in your red light. Um, then uh, what we, we'll see here is we'll try to get as close as we can on reaction time to to the uh, the green light. So we'll probably start moving just before the green light. So by the time the green light flashes, we're on our way. We'll uh, try to get a good light, not a perfect light this time. Mr. Bill tempted me off the line last time he left so early. He's going to have a good race with uh, Dylan. That would be a really close race, I think. Look at those flags. The flags are just straight. Straight headwind. So that's going to make it... Uh, that's keeping the miles an hour down, that's for sure. There he is, a bagger. Rogue Glide. Legacy Vets. I have to do this one for Reve Revelator Al. He's going to stage first, I guess. He ain't got the first one on. I ain't got the first one. Pretty good. <laughs> He's shaking his finger at me. He's shaking his finger at me. I just want a big thank you to Roy and Becky for being there and taking some pictures, and and that was really neat, neat having all. And um, I hope I hope my friends over in UK like the drag race. Uh, Richard, just I kind of wanted to do a little bit there for you, and hopefully it turns out all right. We'll see. Well, we're I think we're only going to do three races today, and going to call it quits. Uh, first race I raced against a, a Yamaha R uh, MT07, and I did what I should have done against him. I won that one. I had a nice uh, 11.896. Uh, the second race I raced against Mr. Bill on his Grizzo. And I got 11.731. That's pretty good. It was about the best I've done with that. And uh, to his 12.498. The wind was pretty heavy out here again today. I like to say that's unusual, but it's becoming more usual. And my third race was against a Harley Rogue Glide. And he did a 12.376. So he actually was almost, he, he was pretty quick. I ran 11.817, and uh, my reaction time, I beat him. Uh, he had a good one. He had a .077, which is pretty good. I take that every day. But uh, I, hadn't hit, I had to watch the tape on that one. I had a .003. Not too bad. Well, this is that. Just, just that for today. Heading home.